So we're fighting these mini bosses first that show off the mechanics of the fight. This green guardian first is going to have a mechanic where he places blue patches on the ground under people's feet. Um, under five people's. You have three or so seconds, two seconds. Three. Three seconds. Three seconds. Um, to get out of the blue patch, or it will teleport you to a random spot in the arena, which will probably end up killing you with the other mechanics going on. Um, you can dodge out of them. Any ability, like your short bow three that gives evade frames, works as well. So I know you need to keep up dodges for your rotation, so just use that as your opportune time to dodge so when you yep. see the blues. Um, that's the only mechanic we're going to worry about first. We'll explain them one at a time as we fight the mini bosses. Cool. D DPS always takes a back seat to not getting teleported. Mm -hmm. Yeah, th this is technically the first raid boss, but it is a very mechanic heavy fight. The DPS check is super easy. It is not a it is not a DPS fight. All right, so just mechanics then. Yeah, yeah. Oh, uh, third phase might be a DPS fight. <laughs> if you, no, if I don't you think so. If you play the mechanics perfectly, um, there is no healing check to it. It's just getting hit by mechanics is the only thing that gets people down. Cool. And pulling. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Who picked up Aeris? Like, I love it, Lucera. How did you get that? Get yeah, what? Her name. Okay, break his bar. This there is just walking my dog real quick. Hmm. So that that was the blue mechanic. Pretty straightforward. Is that what they're um, calling that nowadays? Yeah. So before we pull this next boss, this next boss, the red one, is only affected by condition damage. Um, nice. So Brainy, you're yeah, you're a big DPS next to um, Sataka as well. Oh, we have two. Who's our second, Condi? Sataka and Brainy. Yeah, Sataka should be. Oh, Sataka's kind of now. Okay. Yeah. Um, the other mechanic it's going to show off during this phase are Seekers. Um, they are red orbs that are going to float toward the group. They cannot be damaged. They have a red ring around them. They will do a lot of damage to you. So a lot of the fight is going to be Seeker control. Um, we need to push them away. So we have, if you have any skills that have pulls... The Notorious Greatsword 5 or Dragon's Ma on Guardians. Do not use them for these fights. It will be my job to uh, keep them... It will be my job to keep them away from the group. But that won't happen if uh, people are pulling them in. All right, cool. Awesome focus pull. And we are just going to have to kind of rotate around the boss for this beginning phase. Yeah, whatever that pull was, don't do it. I don't know what it was. Oop, down. Get your friends up. Don't yeah, DPS. Get, get friends up. Working on it. See up. There he is. Hopefully during the fight, the tank is not the only one doing focus pulling. <laughs> no, you got me to do pulls. Or pushes. We should be good. Normally, all you need for an organized group is a single druid to um, oh, lift snap. pushes. And you're good. It's just this pre-phase, it's a little bit more rough. Yeah, I keep accidentally uh, doing great swords for you. And just going to outer space. <laughs> The um, 
The orbs can also be rooted in place if you have anything that does that. Yep, they are affected by CC abilities. Green. Okay, so this next phase. Yeah, I should have explained. Everyone get in the green or you die. Get in the green or you die. Perfect, perfect. Yeah, so, only sweet people in the green. It's actually and four. People. Yeah, my mistake. So, green. this is the mechanic in the fight that we're going to do for now. And then we're going to ignore for most of the rest of the fight. There will be some situations where we don't. Um, for each person missing in... So the green, you're supposed to have four people in. For each person missing, it does about 18% of your max health as damage. Um, which, you know, missing... Not having anyone in a green is going to deal about 75% of your max health. So we're going to ignore them. And our healers are just going to carry the group like crazy every time a green pops and get everyone back up to full health. So and you see those zeros? Green, if you want it. Does anybody know why we're getting zeros there? No. Yeah, this guy has a he had to boon strip, and that's why the Chronos use their sword auto attacks to strip boon. Oh. So you have to make sure that you're auto attacking as Chrono on on. Uh, is it just blue? It's just blue. It's just the blue uh, guardian that has that ability during the phase. Hey, what do you guys think of my new Soul Beast DPS? <laughs> Powerful. Looking good. <clears throat> I use uh, Gravity Well for this one, for the CC, right? I would not recommend Gravity Well because that will pull in the Seekers. Moa is much better here. Okay. All right. So for this fight, it's going to be a combination of all three mechanics. Yes. Yeah. Is it going to go in phases or all nope, at the same time? All, all at the same time. So they do have staggered timers. We're going to get a green about every 15 seconds, a blue about every 10 seconds, and Seekers continually. Two Seekers will spawn continually throughout the fight. Um, so greens and blues are done separately, but there is a time like every three or so where they do overlap, where healing is going to be a little bit rougher. Um, and it's super important that people don't get teleported. Otherwise, you're going to go straight to downstate because the green will take you and the healer won't be there to pick you up. Cool. Um, oh. And for the inevitable time when Ugly Timmy gets teleported by accident, do not run after... Bail Guardian, I will come back to the group. All right. I'm going to mark uh, two locations here on the arena. Arrow is where we're going to stack during most of the fight. Um, if, if you get teleported, run back to Arrow. You, sh you should always be standing on Arrow. Boss is going to be tanked at Arrow. At 66%, the boss will phase. Um, he's going to run to the center of the arena and then split into the three mini bosses we just fought. Uh, fought. So we have to split the group up in order to fight and kill each of the three mini-bosses. Um, since the, green, the red one is only affected by condition damage, our two Condis and Boar are going to go to red um, to kill that one. Everybody else is going to go to circle, and we're going to kill both blue and green together. Um, once all three of those mini-bosses are dead, we go back to the regular fight, Vil Guardian respawns, and we tank it back at Arrow. One thing to add, Arrow. What's up? During the split phase, um, when we're tanking blue over at Circle, we are going to do the green circles during split phase. Yes. Okay. I'm going to go bio real, real fast. Fair back. One second here. I got to flip on lights. <clears throat> so, Arrow, do I need to call blue or no? Oh, he's turning on the mood lights. I feel like it probably wouldn't hurt for some of our newer people. Okay. Oh, uh, this fight should I go blue or red? Uh, blue. Or blue. Oh, uh, light. Brainy, Sataka, and Boar are gonna go red. Arrow, I don't gotcha. know if you made 
would you like me to call blue or no? Uh, starting off, yeah, let's do that. All right, I'm only saying blue. When I say blue, we get out of the hitbox of the enemy by double dodging back and walking forward. If you're new to the fight, there is a large blue flame um, that comes up under five different people. The harder we're stacked, the more that they're centered. If you get hit with that blue flame, you get teleported across the arena. Very tough. When I say blue, you need to get out of it and come back to the boss. No matter your rotation, no matter anything. It takes nine full seconds after it goes off for it to respawn. If you're a counter, you can count nine seconds. But I will call blue until we figure it out. Oh my god, I just realized how awesome Soul Beast is for learning this. There are three on short bow, the evade skills, and eight second cooldown without alacrity. Yep. Oh, you don't even have to move. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You just when he yells blues, you just hit short bow three and you're solved. Wait, what? Is it an evade or something? Yeah. It, it's I'll a dodge it. back. It's a dodge back and it keeps his uh buff up as well. What? Yeah. Hmm. It's about the only thing it's useful for. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Well, yeah, they just patch it so it keeps the buff up now. Where it, it didn't uh, Oh, wow, so you don't have to do use your dodge up. And the buff only lasts four seconds, and that skills on an eight-second cooldown. So oh, you okay. Use one dodge, but you don't have to blow both your dodges anymore like you used to have. That's to have awesome. Them. Anyone oh, here have any questions? <clears throat> All right. Waiting on Lucera. I'm gonna re ready up. Lucera is trying to get in Discord real quick. Okay. Yeah, I was asking. Oh, there we oh. go. Hello, Lucera. Hi, positive. Hi, everyone. Hello. Hey. Hope you're having a lovely day. Sorry about that. Yes, I am. Thank you. That's good. Don't I be have... sorry. Do you do you? Well, she was doing my dog. Yes. Oh. Whoa. Oh. I... <laughs> Uh, Whoa. Oh, she's taking care of my dog. Whoa. Whoa. Don't, so, don't say Ranger... stuff like that. Bully. <laughs> well, she's a big dog. I mean, she's like 104 pounds. Oh. Whoa. Whoa. Yes. All right. So, Ranger, Ranger told me that the puppy has not been outside for more than 10 hours, and so he... Wanted to wait to walk her, but that would be 12 o'clock. It's not fair to her, so I took her out really quick. Ah. Uh, oh, I just funny? realized you finally got a good mic, Lassa. No, I'm just using my tablet. I brought the mic. Oh, to okay. To... Yeah. All right, let's rock. We good? You ready, Lucera? Uh, ready on board. Waiting Lucera, on. You... Lucera, do are your, all your amulets and rings and stuff have skill, have stats on them? Oh, let me see. <laughs> This is why I haven't read it. Thank you for the big <laughs> question, Ranger. I haven't. I was not expecting to read it. I'm sorry that you guys had to wait for me. I apologize. No worries. It's always worth to wait for us and people. Oh, yeah. So, also, for those of you that have never done this fight, always make sure you are standing on this stone platform when we pull him. Otherwise, you will instantly die. Oh, yeah. That's important. <laughs> So not here. Not out there. No. <laughs> no, no, no small IQ calf. Thank you. Brainy cow. Small IQ. Well, <laughs> just after five seconds or so, whatever it is, then you can't get off the platform. Just don't start there. Roger. Because you can actually, once the fight started, you know, evade towards the edge of this of the. Um, of the circle and you won't go off. I actually dodge roll backwards into the wall to avoid the blues. <laughs> yeah, I do too sometimes. A good amount. Uh, Lusa, how are we doing with those uh, things? Are the accessories, you mean? And the accessories have no stats. I mean, they do have stats. They just don't have infused. They're not infused or, or anything. That's okay. fine. Are they berserker stats? Yes, they're berserker stats. All right, All right. All right. Let's like rock and roll. Good. It needs to only be infused if you're doing factors. Do, do, 
Oh, but they've okay. got an infusion with the plus five strength I want. Out of the blue. Crack on the butt. Oh, God. Out of the blue. Crack on butt. Whoa. Oh, tank down. Give me your friends. Friend. Yeah, it's Everyone some. Your friends. Hit You're people DPS down, player. revive them. Don't, the don't worry about the DPS. Clear comms, please. Clear comms. No one's making greens. Are we not, are we not doing no greens? No greens, no greens. Okay. Out of blue. Stack tight quick. I got teleported nicely. Yes, I got teleported. Oh, nice. Out of blue. Stack tight. Stay here. Split. Brainy, go to red. Perfect. Folks on the blue side, we are going to start doing greens. Be ready to run to the greens. Green. Greens, guys. Greens. Green. 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 Watch the Watch blue. CC. Blue. I'm sorry. <laughs> CC, if you got it. Awesome. Good Stay timing. here. Do not help red. Mm -hmm. Everyone stack on arrow. Up, they're done. Another stack really on the tank side blue, of the arrow. Blue, blue, Dang it. So now during this phase, we're different parts of the platform are going CC. to light up. If you stand in a part that's lit up, you will take a lot of damage. So don't stand on the glowing part. Hello. Right now, the blue part is lit up. Everyone stand on the other side. Do not stand in the glowing platform. Out of the blue. Thank you. Out of the blue. Okay, we're gonna switch to the other side right now. Switch to the other side. Out of the blue, CC soon, CC soon, out of the blue. Ah, shit. That was my fault. Don't move, I'm coming. CC phase, we're fine. Out of the blue. So everybody stay, everybody stay. Everyone stay, stack stay. up, everyone stack up. Get our friends up. Uh, Tank down. I nope, can't. this is no GG. CC. Nope. This is GG. <laughs> that was uh, pretty decent for a first shot. I think we have some, soon got some new people as well. It's okay. So one thing I will say, please, please clear comms. Please mute your mic. Oh, no this worries is about that. So for, because I please. changed the settings for. So now only officers will have priority speakers. So if comms get crowded, it will bring everyone else down. No, so okay. I would... we don't not appreciate it. But for some people training, the calls need to be clear. Thank you, everyone participating. We're not saying no. Just during training, we're going to keep it clean. Sorry. All right, let's go. But we do appreciate that. That will help. Recovered. Um, uh, Wolfman, you It means we're learning, so it's positive. Sorry. Sorry. Wolfman, yes? Uh, yeah, your, uh, your speakers are still being heard in your mic. You may want to adjust your sensitivity a little more or go on to push to talk. You want me to go to push to talk? I really can't, but I can hear you. I can just um just hear you and not... No, nope, your your comps have been fine, Lucera. Wolfman's uh, some of his speakers have been picked up by his mic. The dogs were mine, just by letting you know. Okay. <laughs> okay. We're gonna pull on ready check.
Out of blue. Stack. Out of blue. Stack. Out of blue. Stack. Out of blue. My Stack. thought went the wrong way. Stack. Everybody stay stacked. Out of blue. Kill your friends. Ah, shit. I need help on secret control. It went down. Okay, we should be good now. Yeah, I'm down. Out of blue. blue. Oops, sorry. Tank's down. Oh, uh, let's oh, GG okay. this. Let's GG this. Too messy. Quick Too messy. reset. Quick reset. We could have recovered, but we wouldn't wouldn't have learned anything. Part of that was my bad. Um, we had people going down on greens because I didn't have people topped off. So we're doing greens now. We are not. We had people go down to greens because I wasn't healing well. That's all I was saying. So that'll be fixed. Oh. I I went dead, so I apologize. It happened. Sarah, looks like you went back to Aerodrome. Up oh, there we go. Oh, hold on. I'm gonna take my ready check back. Wait a minute, take buddy. It back. <laughs> it's ours, man. Ah, uh, there we go. I think that's the right skill. That's what it was. Wait, what do uh, you I didn't think. Ask you have <laughs> professionals here. Ask Ask I didn't. Zero. I didn't have the. I didn't have the skill on that gave my um, six and seven skill distortion. Oh, that should always be selected. By the way, um, if anyone has questions, please ask. Uh, this yeah. is a very comforting area to be in. <laughs> Yeah. Okay, so if, if you're okay with that, I'm going to ask because I haven't played with this. Um, has the rotation changed for Daredevil? No. No. Nope. Uh, hold on. How how long are we talking ago? Uh, maybe like two months. Two months. Oh yeah, not in two months. Not in two months. I was thinking like two years ago okay. is different, but. So I throw down um, Thieves Guild and I throw the swipe and then I'll put down Ooh. Vault and then do my um, number one score for three rotations and then go back right. Yep. To, yeah, okay. Just want to make sure. You're popping your signet on your weakening charge. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah, Bassy Venom may be better for this one, just because the CC okay. bars can get kind of hectic during the last phase. Let me change it then. Yep. Agree. Okay. Agree. But you and that's just for, it, you it. It. huh? You want to hold it until we call for CC. Don't use it randomly. Okay. All right. Oh, me, I'm sorry. And uh, how do I do the ready check thing? Hold on one second. Are you ready? Uh, okay. Got it. Yep. Mm -hmm. All right. And out of blue. Stack. If you're not stacking, you're doing it wrong. Stack on the butt. Out of aggro. Oh my God! I said out of. Aggro. Yes, you did, and I. It's okay. Out. It's okay. It's okay. Focus. 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 God damn it! Out of blue. Where is uh? You got TP'd. Out of blue. Out of blue. Out of blue. Sorry. Out of blue. That was my fault. It was two okay. seconds early. Out of blue. Oh, okay. Get him up, get him up, get him up. DPS, DPS, secret management, out of blue. Oh, come on. 
Back, stay, 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 stay. Everybody stay, everybody stay, everybody stay. Dealer's choice. Out of blue, out of blue. Split. Okay, split. Oh, where do I go? Uh, Over the blue with us, with Sarah. Right Don't Thank go you. to right, go to blue. Got it. Thanks, thanks, thanks. No worries. No worries. No Reminder, yeah, watch out for greens. Greens, please. Go to green. Let's not GG here. Um, green, even though watch out for blue. Shit. Okay, let's GG now. Let's GG now. Two, what? Uh, people weren't standing in greens on our side. I was trying to make a call about something that wasn't mechanic related, and so we beefed up the mechanic. Uh, um, and then the blue went right in the middle of the green. I had to get out. Yep, yeah, please GG. Please, GG. Plant, GG. Thank you. Uh, I'm pretty sure, is it, isn't it? it um, you can use the Dragon Hunter Shield F3 whenever there's a blue and a green to prevent people from getting... Nope. Yeah. Uh, actually, yes. Uh, uh, the blue, the yes. The green, no. Yeah. Yeah, the F3 right. blocks the blue, but if it's in together on your side, yes, you do want to pop that, and it'll block it for, I believe, five people. So, so Right, so we can prevent the green from not registering. So no. the issue... Can I explain more? Yes, please, sorry. Okay, so um, Aegis blocks the blues from taking damage on you. When the blues take damage, that's when they teleport on you. So blocks work for that. The problem with Aegis is if any blues are stacked, because we're stacking tightly, and multiple people are standing in the blues, you can't stack Aegis, and so it will teleport you anyway. So blocks work much better. Now, greens cannot be blocked or distorted. You always... Well, they can't be blocked. They can be distorted. You always take damage from greens unless you're a Chronomancer using a distortion skill like your Signets now. Yeah, so if you have, like, a long-duration block skill, that's preferred to use over the blues as opposed to giving people Aegis. Yes. So, yes to your question, Ranger. But it's better than nothing if, if there's a green with blues spawning in it to pop the S3. You, you can, but it's, it's not as safe. Yes. And yeah. out of the blue. Stack beyond the butt. Out of the blue. Stack tight for heals. Still out of the blue. Out of the blue. Guess what? Out of the blue. Stack tight. Ah, shit. Stay, stay, stay. Seeker control. Stay. Everybody stay tight. Wolves are hopefully coming. Out of the blue. Tank down. Out of the blue. Res up. Res the tank, please. Easy. Out of the blue. Seeker control. No, stack, stack, shit. I didn't see it. Sorry. Res. Go to your spot. Brainy, go to red. Four, go to red. We'll yep. be good. My bad. I didn't see it's it. Okay. A reminder, blue people, we're going to be doing greens. Go to green. Help me. Res your bud. Watch out Always for Always res your bud. Thank you. Oh, man. We hit again. Green. Watch out for blue. the blues. Watch the blues. Yeah, Ooh, and everyone got ported. CC, blue. Watch out for blue. Raise your friends. Oh, yeah, good. Uh, blue. This is a GG. This is a GG. So. Yeah, so I tried to use my F3 and I still got ported, just like you said.
Yep, because we had everyone stacked. So, um, we're going to make a slight alteration to what we normally do. Um, Lothar, I do not want you doing greens when we do that middle phase. We have... Ah. Wait. Hold on. When we do this... When, the, when we do the split phase, I do mm -hmm. not want you do, doing greens. We have seven people, so we have more than enough to get in greens. Um, and then that. So you what do you the, just keep blue where he is? Just, just keep it stationary. Um, that way, it reduces. Um, oh, hold on! No, it's it's green that spawns the blue circles, isn't it? Yes. Okay. Now there isn't a good way of doing that. Then never mind. You do generally try to want to keep the boss outside of the green circles, though. So it, don't run greens. It's fine. You can keep them close to the group so we can still do is, like is he, range. Is he affected by um, toughness? The I, didn't, I didn't think the ads were. No, they're not. What is, what's their aggro mechanic? Uh... The druid pulls green onto blue. You stand on super speed mushroom and you fuck up blue as quick as you can until the first green spawns and everyone gets in green. Blue pulls the green. You quick kill it and then you fight green. Or, I'm sorry, blue and then you fight green. Okay, it's, so, it's so let's not bother same. cleaving them then. No, no. You, you stack on him, you wait three seconds and then start hacking the shit out of blue, then move to the green he spawns He'll die here if your DPS is good enough. If you get that green, that's what Ranger was saying. You pop that Guardian F3, that'll block the group if the blues are in the green, and you continue to DPS. Uh, this is, that's a great training issue because it happens in pugs, so it's a really good thing to keep seeing because it happens a lot. Gosh, I love that Nevermore. So does Lusa. That's <laughs> so cool looking. I think it's even better on a Norn when the staff is like huge. Look at my boobs. <laughs> the brat. No, thank you. Them, them be uh, Norn boobs. I wish uh, Lusa would look at those and hit ready check. So, uh, so she, was, looking at her boobs. she was checking after the cats. She should look at my boobs. I'd rather not. Boobs. She's about to ready check though. Boobs. Out of blue. Stack tight. Out of the blue. Out of the blue. Where is it? There it is, out of the blue. Why did it take so long? Am I lagging? Nope. All right, that wasn't me, right? Out of the blue. No, it wasn't you. Like, what the hell? <laughs> out of the blue. Stay stacked. Stay stacked. Stay stacked. Out of the blue. Out of the blue. Stack. All right, split, split, split. Nice. Easy. Get ready to do greens. Green. Greens, guys, greens. All right, get him. Watch out for blue. Ooh, lucky me. Green. CC. Rez. Get your buddy up. Rez. Green, watch Rez. out for gr I'm watch out for blue, I'd rather. Rez healer. Thank you. You get my druid juice back. Rip. Whoop. Help. Rez. Rez. Your job is Rez. We Watch out to. for teleport. Res everyone. Get everyone up. We're going to stand here. It's going to suck, but we got to get everyone up. Out of blue. 
I okay, I'm gonna interrupt. I'm gonna move him. You guys keep rezzing. Great. <laughs> We're trying. We got everybody? No, we got CC. And, uh, so we're gonna GG here. We're gonna GG here. Um, the issue there was not having enough heals. I was having to stop to res people because people weren't resing. So have Bor go to. And I was just gonna ask that. Okay. <laughs> I totally forgot, Soda. You were on that side. Um, sorry. That's that's my fault. Yeah, I bet Soda and Brainy got it no problem. Yeah, they do it, Soda. Uh, that's embarrassing. Sorry. Uh, actually, do we want to send a Chrono over with you guys? Because when when you guys had three with you before, split times were pretty even. I'd kind of like to keep that. Uh, Chrono wouldn't make that much of a difference. No. Okay. Same as that. Oh, not for you. Just have everybody else there. And two at red. Even if red takes a little bit slower... It's better to have blue and green more consistent. Also, blue and strip for blue. Yeah. Out of blue. Stack. Out of blue. Out of blue. Hmm. Out of blue? Yep, blue spawn. Yep. Out of blue. Blue spawning. Out of blue. Good job not getting teleported, guys. We're about to phase. Split. Not spawn. Perfect. Green. Green. Well, oh, watch out for blue, watch out for blue. CC. Tough. There we go. Wait for red, do not go in. Alright, let's go. That's On arrow. On Timmy's side of arrow. Blue. CC. Who's the other person? Oh. My fault. I missed that one. <laughs> Going GG. We had three people get teleported. We should have zero. Oh. Okay. Sorry, missed that one. Rotation is sucking. Just don't get teleported. Even your auto attacks, you'll be fine. I uh, know. I'm. I'm okay with. Ain't the very first time. The first couple of times I was. <laughs> I didn't jinx myself. We have plenty of DPS to beat this. We just gotta not mess with the mechanic. So the best way to prevent from getting ported is dodge rolling out when we call blues being. In. Um, they can be hard to see, 
while you are still learning. Their tell is very subtle. It'll take a while. It'll take several pulls before you'll finally like start reliably seeing them. And I feel like most classes don't have to stack right up on top of the boss. So you can just be like max melee range like you talked about for KC. Yeah, but we have to be stacked for heals. Well, right, so, but... so you want to be stacked as tight as possible so the blues all spawn on top of each other so you have to move less distance. Throughout the entire fight, you want to be stacked as tightly as possible. You do not want to max melee this boss at any point outside of if blues have just spawned and you're moving out of them. Oh, okay. I thought somebody told me the other other way when I was in a training run. Never I always max stay melee on top this. of them because I'm a dragon hunter. So yep. No, never max melee this. Stack as tightly as possible. You do not want to be able to see your character model on this fight. Because it'll make the blues spawn farther back. Yep. And then uh, okay. people can roll, roll into them and not have the evade frames for it. Oh, okay. Out of blue. Out of blue. Dodge back. We're going to GG. What happened? Right when I got. Right. Uh, we had someone get ported. Because right when I asked people to stack, they were not stacked. He dodged roll back into someone else's blue who was not on top of the group. So, the one thing I asked for, we did not do, and I killed someone. I'm coming back. I just clicked the wrong button. Double check your food. Refood up. Do not pull boss yet. Do not pull boss yet. Okay. Pulling. Thanks for that ready food check. Out of blue. Stack. Keep going. Stack tighter. Stack tighter. I see people in the back. Stack mm -hmm. tighter. Why, why is that not showing up? Alright, so I accidentally just dodge rolled off the side. Sorry. Yep. Stack tight, stack tight, stack tight, tight. Dodge oh, roll back. Blue. Beautiful ah. blue placement, and people still got teleported, but that was beautiful blue t placement. Out oh, blue. Stack, stack, we're good. Out of blue. Tank's down. Res. Out of blue. Man, I was not in. I'm next to you guys. Thank you. Back on group. Stack tight, stack tight. You should not stack, play stack, 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 stack. Okay. Yeah, because we had a green going off because our DPS was too slow. So uh, there are some points when we phase, we do not want to run to our positions yet. We want to delay it. Uh, GG, by the way, everyone GG. We want to delay it if a green has spawned because if everyone goes running off in different directions, I can't heal you and you will die. And we don't want that because there is a lot of healing pressure during the split phase already. Okay, good to know, thank you. Lothar will be the only person, hopefully, that is in a position where he is able to see the green circles because everyone should be facing the boss in the wall. So Lothar, I'm gonna leave that call to you if a green is spawning 
and we're approaching split phase. <laughs> I did scream it, but nobody listened to me. <laughs> yes. So I'm letting <laughs> this. I'm letting the party know when Lothar screams it. Listen to him because he's the only one that can see what it's what's going on. I remember the priority speakers on, so if you're forward talking, it's gonna drown him out. So that's why. Okay. Doc, if you want me to. Oh, and I gotta see something really Whoops. quick. I'm sorry, I gotta check something really quick. Stacking was much better as a whole. Um, I think during the during the third uh, blue, we were a little slow to get back together as a group. That's why someone went to downstate because I couldn't get heals on them fast enough. Um, that's next to not getting port ported. The other important part about stacking is that we sometimes have greens and blues overlap. So the closer you are as a group, the more I can prevent you from going down. As an incentive to stack on the group, a lot of uh, Natasha's heals heal people in front of her, so don't be behind the firebrand. <laughs> No, Lou Sarah says she's having a hard time auto attacking. It's not. It's not doing my auto attack, and I'm checking my options to um, see. The Lou Sarah doesn't have uh, two arrows around your auto attack. Arrows. Yes. No. Okay. So yeah. control and right click it. Oh, you can change it that easily. Yep. Yep. Oh, oh my okay. gosh! I didn't know that. You can also assign one of your other skills to auto attack. It's a useless part of the game that should be removed. No, so wait, I did see an arrow, but I didn't see two arrows. There is one it's... along the top and one along the bottom. It like makes a loop around it. Oh yeah, okay. So it's still it, okay. It was on, and so hold on. Let me just. I gotta move something. I gotta move something. It's probably just in the way. Yeah, Daredevil staff auto has got weird priority when working with some other skills. I know. So, does, so do I need to change something? I don't think so. This is probably because um, this is in the right. So. <laughs> Somebody said they're letting their dog out now, right? So are you guys again? Oh. That was Plant, and he's back. Oh, yeah. that's fast. You just open the door, let him go run out in traffic. It's all good. <laughs> what I do. Out of the blue. Stack. Hey, Brainy. <laughs> Welcome back. Four, did you GG? Well, of course, dude. We're not doing that in the first. Let's go. I was gonna make him sit and watch. No. I wanna Eight make him sit and learn. All right, that's the second time it happened. I have five seconds before the wall comes up. Mm -hmm. So if you ready check, I assume you're standing on the stone platform. There's no reason not to be. No, I, I was. I just dodge roll off it instinctually, and I just. I don't oh know. right, because that's part of your rotation. There's, I'm just. Oh. It's like it's like the Reaper Five when I pulled uh, Lothar and uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Why I haven't forgotten yet. <laughs> no, wait, you don't have to dodge if you're running uh, dagger and torch short bow, right? No, he's running short bow, short bow. It uses uh, yeah. fast on your feet instead of quick draw. Or That's what I'm saying. Feet. Does he have dagger, torch? It's a whole different rotation, though. I yeah, don't yeah. really want to mess with that. Um, okay. It's totally different for, like, 1k more DPS. It's not worth it. No, I'm saying you don't have to dodge then, which is nice. Sorry, I need a quick bio, so be right back. Okay, I'm going to yeah, rest. Time. I'm going bio too. Yeah, yeah. You, 
take a quick break. Yep. Five minutes. Damn, I might Hi. need another beer. Hi, everyone. Well done. Uh -huh. <laughs> Hello, hope you're having a lovely day. I do. Thank hey. you. Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night. No, 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 I mean good night as... Good night, like uh, hello. Let us uh, know good night. It's good evening. You mean like Guggenheim. Oh. He used me the first time when he joined Guild and said that, our Discord. Aloha. Perfect, Nugan. So Ranger, I, ju I just uh, wrote up about the differences between those two rotations, and it's uh, Dagger Torch works more like a classic loop rotation, like some of the early rotations that QT advertised, where um, Shorpo Shorpo is a cooldown based rotation, like a lot, right. of, a lot of other MMOs work rotations. That's why I feel like Dagger Torch Shorpo is, out of all the classes I've played, is the one that feels most like Dragon Hunter. Yeah, because there are very few rotations left in the game that are still perfect loops. That's kind of an artifact of, like, class design back from when Heart of Thorns was originally released. Yeah, that's so why like, I, I've, I've almost finished gearing up my Soul Beast so that, you know, I feel like Soul Beast might be better than Mirage for fights like this where we had to bring... Well, I think... Yeah, I think they say Condi Firebrand... Tends to be a best in slot Condi for this fight. Or no, oh, no right. Hall Smith. Either of them. I'm running full heals, not not Condi. Yeah, yeah, I know you are. Oh, wait, fuck me. Uh, <laughs> did I change my... Oh, sorry, I mean, uh, F the thing. Sorry. Yeah, yeah, I was, I was running Condi Chrono here the other night we were doing this too. And obviously you were doing well with it too. Oh, um, yeah. It's a, it's a fun... It's remember, well suited remember, for this fight. Remember the thing we talked about where, you know, things show up in your inventory? Yeah, that was that. Good. How did I do? Uh, Condi Firebrand isn't too hard. It's less loopy, though, and more um, cooldown-y. I don't know. Oh, less loopy. Right. That's fun. Alright, sweet. What? Am I getting yelled at via DM? No. No, okay, I take that back. It's a loop and a cooldown base. So your weapon skills are all doing loop stuff. But then, like, all your utilities and mantras and stuff, that's that's kind of just, like, as you see them. Oh, Condi Firebrand is amazing. Yeah. I just hate power Firebrand. Yeah. No, it's a pretty, it's a pretty easy rotation to learn. I'll have to try it, then. I mean, I've got all the gear. I just have to put it on this guy. Yeah. And, like, you're not punished nearly as hard as you are in Dragon Hunter for not lining up your burst windows correctly. Because, like, there's more stuff to line up in center of your symbols for Condi Firebrand. So, like, you can more easily miss those lineups. But since your Condi, like, your Condi isn't affected by those. So it's not as big of a deal as Dragon as, Hunter. As long as you use your pulls correctly, you can do a reverse burst. You don't have to follow rotation as long as the enemies are there. If it's solo boss, yeah, follow rotation. But as long yeah, as yeah. You, you can purge high on multi, like Zara especially, pff, fuck that. Okay, um, 25 easy. Yeah, as far as burst goes, uh, Condi Firebrand and Condi Weaver are like the two fastest bursting Condi classes. For burning, though. Uh, just as far as like getting Condi's out fast, and yeah, burning is some of the highest burst damage, just because it ticks so heavy. Yeah, the that's why Firebrand's so good for this, because you need to get it out fast during those. Yeah, Hollow. Yeah, Hollow is another one that sacks it pretty fast too. All I know is, you know, if I have a really long fight, my Mirage does great, but. I'm always below just about every other mirage that I see at the start. Oh, Sorry. Sorry. GG. Uh oh. Sorry, I was trying to stack quickness and shit and I pushed wrong button. Sorry, bad finger. So I also made a quick video you might want to check out. If you get back to benchmarking Mirage, it should help you uh it's on reading logs to help with your Mirage benchmarks so you know how much confusion you're stacking. Don't don't forget to repair if you need to repair, guys. 
Well, that's where I was doing well. I'm stacking the confusion really well, but oh, you I'm okay. you missing welcome. something with the the starting rotation and other. Like I noticed, I did a Karen run with. Um, there was like four of us, I think, or maybe five of us were running Mirage, and I wound up with the second highest DPS in the group. But oh, for yeah, you were a slow good to stack it though. Minute, yeah, I, yeah, I was fight. way slower than the other ones to stack. So I'm clearly doing something wrong at the beginning. Big one Same up. thing with Mursad Overseer. I know it's supposed to be fairly strong in Mursad Overseer, but my Dragon Hunter does like 5k DPS more than my Mur Big one that people unintentionally do is that they dodge when they use Axe. Throw. You're not supposed to do that. Wait, what do you mean? Like, at the same time you're casting Axe 3? or They dodge during Axe 3. Um, when you're going towards some whatever you're hitting. And generally, whenever you do dodge, you know, you get the ambush. So their uh, mindset is when they dodge during Axe 3, they'll have an ambush off cold, but it doesn't actually proc because of the timing. You have to land, then dodge. Yeah, you have to land, then dodge. Yeah, I do that part it, right. It gets canceled, right? Yeah. Yeah. It's and it's weird. It's worried weird on the website where it says, "Yeah, use dodge during." Yeah, act this, three, don't use it. Don't don't follow the website. They've yeah, it, it's, it's worded incorrectly. They've cooked. Well. I wish, I wish Anet would give you the option to save your like raid zone from week to week. Like, save just your like fucking to... lockouts. Yeah, what? I know, right? Well, I'm just like. I'd like to like not have to like get through all of, you know, the rest of the wing to get back to Zara. Yeah, the I thing just, is, like, just raid wings are so short in here compared to every other MMO that it's not worth it. Once once you start ripping through it, you'll get why it is. Yeah. The other thing too is like raid bosses generally like start easier and get harder for most wings. So it's not like you know, in WoW progression where it's sometimes like boss number four out of nine is your gatekeeper. And so you kill it once and then never do that fight again and you just save your lockout every week. Nope. Right back. Right back. What? Right back. What is Redder talking about? Oh, uh, I think I think he's in a uh, meta group. Oh, meta. Uh, Wolfman, you coming back? You DC? I think he just transformed. It, is it twelve? Is there seven? Should we get Killjoy in here then if he dropped? <laughs> oh no, I'm sorry, I was doing something. I PM'd. Yeah, it looks like he's on his login screen. He might have DC'd. Yeah. He's not responding he's not. in Discord. Oh, he's back. Oh, okay. Cool, cool, cool. Back again. Eh, no. I might only have a few more pulls in me, though, because I feel like me and Lucera probably should hang out a little bit. You are hanging out. I was going to say, you're spending quality time together right now. <laughs> we're, in, we're in two different rooms. I, I hate it because we have to be in separate rooms. It's almost like I'm in Columbia still. Oh, well, you're Why? close. Okay. It's because, um, yeah, it's because uh, we need to figure out how to... To connect. I gotta get her uh, Wi-Fi on her desktop. Okay. Oh, hold on. Get... 
We the thing is like this, you are the two persons in this guild that are the closest ones right now. What are you doing? Yeah, she's like in the other room. Lucera, are you ready? Uh, no, I haven't. She was like, what are you doing, Bella? Um. Oh, Kitty's trying to fight again. All right, twenty on the gray one. Just let him go at it and keep the one that wins. There you go. <laughs> Less hassle once you buried the other one. We do have five of them in the house right now, so that's not necessarily. Oh, a bad. battle royale! Oh. <laughs> Cage <laughs> match. <laughs> <laughs> we have we have five cats and five dogs in the house. Just okay. lock him in the room. Put a little video recorder. Are you? Do you actually work at a park, or are you a park ranger in your apartment? <laughs> no, no, I, I have a house at the state park. <laughs> do you have a basement, and are there people? <laughs> <laughs> no, and you know what's funny? If the dogs got into a fight, the little white Chihuahua beats up on my hundred-pound Anatolian Shepherd Great Pyrenees. <laughs> Nice name drop. Can we get a nice ready check? Uh, we have a ready check. We're waiting on Lucera to get back to her computer, I guess. <laughs> she just asked me where the sleeping bag is because she wants to lay it out for the cat to, to have a nice, comfy you should, blank. You okay, we're pulling. We're pulling. Oh, we're pulling. We're pulling. Out of the blue. Oh, my God. Oh, great. That's what she said. <laughs> I'm sorry. Out of the blue. Into the stack. Stack tight. Stack tight. Stack tight. Brainy. Tighter. Tighter, Brainy. Thank you. Out of the blue. Res your bud. Res your bud. Oh. They're way right. far She's away. Only way away. We're, we're not resing that. She's okay. Not here. No, no, no. Out of the blue. Actually, great blue placement. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Excellent. Stacking has gotten much better, guys. Thank you. Making my job easy. Out of the blue. blue. Nice. Wow. Out of the blue. Out of the blue. Yeah, that one was a little bit messier, guys. It's okay. It's okay. You got a port. Out of the blue. Out of the blue. Okay, we don't Split. have green. We are good. Split. You're lit? Uh, always, but split. Oh. How did I get all the way over here? Oh, I got ported. Never mind. Green. Everyone in green? Out of the blue. Rip. Yeah, I couldn't. <laughs> yeah, this is GG. That bad. Blues were a lot better. Um, the one time we did get blue spread out, someone got ported. So I think um, we're just going to have to be really consistent. Yeah, I did. Back. That's my bad. Yeah, my hand was off keyboard, so once we did that quick pull, I hit the wrong key to, to dodge. Sorry. I readied up, but that was like 10 minutes ago. So. <laughs> it's fair. <laughs> <laughs> All right, lock the TV up. He won't be getting into any any messes again. <laughs> he hasn't been that bad. Tonight's been his worst night, so. I was about to attack him because he cornered one of the smaller cats. I don't know if you heard him. <laughs> you know there was open chat. I don't know if you heard Ranger. He was yelling. <laughs> I was about to whoop some ass, though. Yeah, he was hiding. He He... I found him though, and he was still afraid to come out. Good, that's what he gets for beating up another cat. All right, big focus, big focus, big focus, big focus. Here we go. Out of the blue, out of the blue. Stack tight. Whoa, port on the first blue. Where is he? 
What happened yeah, that's there? Weird. Now it's spawned. It, yeah, it didn't. I'm sorry, but it didn't show up. I can't call it if it doesn't show up. Yeah, that's no, what it's been doing for me. Out of the blue. Hey, dodge out, dodge out. Uh, sack tight for heals. Shit. We're good. I'm so thrown We're off. Not. Tank down. Gotcha, bro. Out of the blue. Stack up tight, stack up tight, stack up tight. Ah, oh, damn it. Tank down again. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. Out of the blue. Stack tight for heels. Out of the blue. Ooh. Oh, come on. Um, let's go in GG. This fight is bugging out right now. Blues are not spawning when they're supposed to be. Um, the one time you didn't see them before, they spawned four seconds after they were supposed to. So that's not a rotation, rhythm, anything. That's just the the fight's not working the way it's supposed to. And two runs ago, they didn't spawn for 18 seconds in a row. So it wasn't just me. No. All right. No, this fight is currently bugged. Um, yeah, I couldn't see the blue as well. Yeah, and... When they are spawning half the time, I'm just not seeing them. I know how to look for them. So I'm, let, I'm we're gonna on this. we're gonna give up on this fight. There are just too many mechanics for a training run right now um, that aren't working the way they're supposed to be working to make any reliable progress. It's just gonna be a crapshoot whether or not we get anything out of this. Um, let's move on to Gorsville. Yes. Does someone have one? I'll yep. buy one real quick. Oh, okay. No, we. I thought we have it. Doesn't yeah, we do? We all did it. It was it was Cyber's instance because oh. no one else has killed just BG and Spirit Run this week. Uh, hold on. I'm um, I'm free now. If you need me. Do you have a Gorsable instance? <laughs> I, I'm not sure. I I doubt it. <laughs> For oh, Gorsable, do you guys want power, Condi, or uh, Alacrity? Power. Oh, oh whoa, whoa. hold on, hold on. Alacrity Ooh. came into play? Did I hear again? Did you feel it? I have an Alacrity, yes. And I have just enough Ascended Gear on it to where I can give permanent uh, Alacrity. Or Diviner's Gear, sorry. What do you guys want? Uh, hold, hold tight, hold tight. Someone left. Arrows by arrows getting a uh, instance. How much is it to get an instance? Yeah, five how gold. much? You it's five um, gold. Five gold. Uh, all right, you already donut done. Yeah. Not a big deal. All right. I didn't know it was that cheap. I still can't believe that group I was in just barely missed beating CM Samurai twice. That was a that was a crazy fight. What is challenge mode on here? Is it still like the eighty percent reduced healing or? Nah, no. This isn't fractal type stuff. Yeah, I've, I've never done a raid challenge mode. I will get to that. <laughs> Just look up Samrog CM on like a YouTube video. Mm -hmm. Just keep showing up. <laughs> we'll, we'll um, do it. How does um, how terrible is my uh, DPS? When you're pretty here, solid, horrible. <laughs> Dude, did you say when I'm here, horrible? No, 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 I, no, no, I said so, so when you're away, horrible. I so said when you're here, amazing. Okay. <laughs> there was something exactly. horrible. No, no, I could come up from He did say that. Whoa, 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 buddy. I think everybody's speaking Russian. This is a crazy evening. <laughs> no worries. It's miscommunication. No worries. Can I get a re-invite to squad? Yeah, except in guild chat.
Um, I'm gonna um, kick. I'm four. I'm gonna kick. Oh, okay. Yep. Happen. Happen. My you poor butternut squash is wearing off in 20 seconds. Nobody join. Nobody do anything here. Everybody just stay here. If you get invited, don't take it. Don't go to spirit fail yet. Don't, don't do, do it yet. Please. <clears throat> All right, we're going in now. No. Now I'm confused because there's two characters named Eris. No, there's not. <laughs> there won't be in a second. Oh, that's funny. Oh, my. Yeah, they copied your name, Lucera. Hmm. Yeah, you're so awesome. They want to be you. Except I've seen that person before. <laughs> Can somebody explain? Because I'm not there and I, I want to understand. <laughs> <laughs> so, Lucera made a character named Eris because of maybe a Greek goddess, perhaps? Yeah. Um, that lady, Eris, uh, she's been playing Guild Wars for over 15 years. Uh, she's one of the more hardcore elitist type people in the game. She has multiple, multiple accounts. She's so well known in Guild Wars 2 for specifically opening any boss every week, anytime you want for five gold. So as soon as reset hits, she has five accounts that she runs through with multiple different guilds and people. And she opens different bosses on different accounts and then just leaves those accounts active to do what just happened. We just bought a Gorsaval incense from Eris because that's her activity. She provides that for the past five years. Five years of raids. Five. Um, oh, wow. I know Eris. Uh, four years of raids. Yeah, yeah, four years of raids. I know Eris personally uh, since Guild Wars 1. Um, hey. She is amazing. So Nice. Can we join you yet, Arrow? Yeah, yeah. No, the instance is good. All right, we're coming in. So that's amazing. So you guys want alacrity? Fuck it, yeah. So come to the lay rift and just pick um which one? Cemetery? That one? Yeah, yep. cemetery. Alright. Hey Boar, you wanna keep doing um heal? Heal brand? Full heal, you want me to go Condi quick? Full well, heal. you you still give permanent quickness as uh, full heal, don't you? Yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah okay. So you keep doing what you're doing. Okay. Um, I'll I'll tank the I'll tank the boss. I'm power Thank quick. You. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, both Chronos. Can I have you swap to uh, DPS classes instead? Sure. Oh, sure. Um, uh -oh. the Ranger. Can I have you go Druid? I was about to ask. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I want you to go to Druid. Whoa, Ranger can play a Druid. He pretends he can. What? <laughs> wow. I don't have a druid at work. I do not have a druid at work. Damn. Order. Arrow, um, do you prefer do you prefer uh, Condi um, Zerker banners or Power Soul Beast? Uh, hmm. Let me see squad. Also, is there any other healer in here? Besides Ranger will be. No, 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 no. I mean, besides me, is there anyone else who would like to play a healer? <laughs> All right, here I am. <laughs> <laughs> I have a heal tempest if you really want him. <laughs> no, no, I want Boar given quickness on heal brand. <laughs> yep. Boar knows what's what. Well. So, did we have someone leave? I'm confused. I'm almost to that. Oh, yeah. Really yeah. yeah. Sa salad boy left. Salad yeah. boy. Hey, <laughs> Who? No bullying. Right. It's I like plants or something. 
it well, was. I forget what his name was. No, it was Wolf, Wolfman. Wolfman. <laughs> Wolfman. Yeah. Plants are great or it something. Was in Discord, by the way. So I'm just I could I'm at my loading screen. I can't see his name. <laughs> yes, people who dislike um Discord. Discord. Number, one. Number two. Uh, his name was I like plants. Was it? I, no, it was plant something. It was plant. plant. He likes, I like plant people. Plant, plant lives matter. Yeah, plant people. Oh my god, I want that name. <laughs> plant lives matter. I'm re- <laughs> I am renaming, <laughs> I am renaming <laughs> my chrono to plant lives matter. Oh, he's right now. here. He's right here. It's plant people rule, and his name mm. is Wolfman. Oh, okay, plant people rule. Okay, that there we go. Yeah. Wait, where is he? He was. Isn't he? Um. Oh, maybe he was. He was in in Discord. I don't see him anymore. Arrow, which one do you want? Um, Good warrior, word. please. Warrior. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Right. I don't uh, do you guys usually start off with axe or staff on druid now? Um, I normally start with axe so I can pop warhorn five and get the fury roll on immediately. Yeah, so I couldn't remember if I'm supposed to swap to that immediately and then use five so I get the quick draw. No, I'm quick, saying. Quick draw, McGraw. Hmm. Oh, yeah, you're not supposed to be running quick draw. Oh, you're not anymore? No, no, no. Um, you run the uh, bottom trait. It gives Fury. Fury. Yeah, Fury gives you 30% instead of 20 and like 150 extra precision. It's amazing. Or 150 extra ferocity. It's awesome. Oh, so that just gives me a little bit of extra damage? Yeah, yeah. Should you're running full Harriers, it? right? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, then it's great. If you're running like full magis or minstrels or some crap like that, then yeah, you'd run quick draw. But oh, gain fury when swapping weapons too. That's only on you, unfortunately. That's still cool. Yeah. 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 Oh wow, so I can do. I've got a pretty decent critical hit chance with these, so I can do some halfway decent bleeds too. Exactly. That entire trait line is built around inflicting bleeds and fury, so. And I'm supposed to do Nature's Vengeance, right? <laughs> oh, um, no, bye. no. Can you can you read off what order you have of skills in that line? Why is there no commander? Those are the three options right there. Spirit activated skills affect a larger area and apply boons to allies. Yeah, I'm sure that's yeah, probably yeah. what it is. Oh, it's, it's because I... Uh, Left squad to uh, find the incense. Arrow? Yeah, I, I will take it, please. It's Rin from legal department. Thank you. <laughs> All right, guys, just a PSA. Um, I'm going to spam my F4 as much as I can to give you guys alacrity. Uh, aside from that, I have no clue how to play this class. Um, I was playing it earlier after not running the right traits before. You just mm -hmm. hit pretty much every other button off cooldown and you do damage. So F4, always priority, and then every oh. other button. Yeah. Well, like, don't use sword 3, because that's terrible. But, like, 2, two four, five, just spam 2, 4, 5 when they're off two, cooldown. 2, 4, 5. And then staff, only for the 5 CC. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Some, um, some skills don't burn so much off cooldown. Give it, like, a second or two, so you stagnate uh, the rotation. All You'll right. figure it. The entire thing is just energy management. It's your mm -hmm. goal is to have enough energy to use F4 and try to keep in both impossible odds and then the Kala Elite up. And then whatever you have left over, you just burn on skills and you try to get that under 10 energy when you go to Legend Swap. So just um, always have up the skill that's burning uh, energy F4 always, 245, heal skill as needed. And then, anything else? Yeah, no, that that should get you there. All right, and then staff five for CC. Okay. So, um, Arrow, do you want to stagger our distorts, or our distorts are only five, so we got to do them at the same time? Yeah, we'll do them at the same time. Um, 
guardians who are here are dragon hunters. Uh, Matt, uh, your F3 does block his big attack. Um, that's that very important. That shouldn't be necessary. Oh, no, like, so I could just time it. But just save it. Uh, myself <laughs> and Arrow will do all of the blocking, but just in case it's mistimed or something happens, save your F3. It's not part of your rotation. Just hold it in canister if you see things going awry. Arrow's calling, so... And I'm gonna hope I can do halfway DPS with this thing. So, um, Boar's the second healer? Yeah. Okay. Yep, so Ranger, if you want to bring... Damn it! Oh! oh. oh. Okay. Everyone GG. Everyone GG. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that raven. Uh, <laughs> it, it was mine again. Sorry, everyone. Push from. <laughs> is it what? just me, or does this boss look like does he them off? Yeah, pretty much. Saucy GG. I he's, think uh, he's one for a bio. Right oh, yeah, yeah. all right, no worries. He'll die in a second. There we so, go. <laughs> you said xenomorph, but I heard Desi the muff. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry about that. Good. I'm sorry about that. It was my fault. Oh I crap! Oh, my good. mantras now. Thanks, Boar. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> oh there it is. Okay. Um, has anyone not done this fight before? I have never done this fight before. Okay. I haven't. What? Do you have to like start? Right, right. Clear comms. Clear comms. Please, we're gonna explain training. Please. So, uh, this is a fairly straightforward boss. Um, it is more of a DPS check than anything. Um, actually, make sure I have the right traits on here. Perfect. Okay. Um, we are going to ignore three of his mechanics. Yeah, three mechanics. Uh, the first mechanic we're going to ignore is um, he is going to every couple auto attacks um, raise his arms in the air and then slam them down. Both Boar and I are going to Aegis the group so that those blocks do not knock you down. If they do knock you down, it's like a six, five, six second knockdown. It's a huge damage loss. Um, it does a bunch of damage. So in order to make sure that works correctly, everyone needs to be stacked as tight as possible because Dragon Hunter Mont or Firebrand Mantras are actually pretty terrible skills with very tiny ranges. So, uh, there's no need to dodge. Um, if you dodge, that will actually get you out of the stack, and you will not get the buffs the boar and I are giving you. So, stay stacked tight at all times. Um, after he does that for a little bit, he is going to start pounding the ground, as we just saw before we wiped, and black goop is going to spawn around, um, the arena, around him in circles. This is the point where we want to stay stacked, but be mobile as a group. You do not want to stand in the black goop. After about two or three seconds, it's going to tick for a large amount of damage. If you're standing in the black goop, it does about three quarters of your health bar. Also important during that slam phase um, is he gets a stack of super retaliation that cannot be removed from him, unlike the other buffs on VG. Um, so any damage you do to Gorsival during that... Um, while he's pounding the ground phase, is going to be reflected back onto you, um, and you're going to quickly drop yourself into down state. Uh, so during that pounding phase, only auto attack. He's also going to have a CC bar. Um, we should have the right classes here to be able to blow up the CC bar pretty quickly. Um, Brainy, that's when you're going to swap into your staff as a uh, lacrigade and just go ham with staff five when he starts pounding the ground to break the CC. Uh, Boar and I should have other pretty controlled breaks with Bane Signets. But if you have CC, just kind of drop it during that phase. Yes, sir. I'm not running Bane Signet. Oh, yeah, yeah, you're not. Don't worry. Okay, we got I, you covered I, then. I could, though. I could. It doesn't change the what I do. Entangle does not come back fast enough. Okay. Um... So, so I should after, only use it on the spirit phase. Correct. Yes. yes. Um. Actually, let me mark for that. 
Yep, so after we break his CC bar, he goes back to kind of how the first phase works, um, where he's just going to attack, slam the ground. Um, and then after so after five auto attacks, he is going to do a big, giant orange AoE that's going to light up the arena and kill us. So in order to prevent that from happening, we have to DPS him down to 66% um, in order to phase him properly. If we do not hit 66%, it is a wipe. Um, if we do that properly, I'll explain the following phase as we go, because I don't feel like talking that much more right now. I say, feel like I said enough. Ready, check. Check for food, especially if you just swap builds. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. Oh, shit. Um, so, uh, I don't have any food or utility or, uh, whatever. One sec here. What are you? No, uh, lacquer gate. He's power. Yeah, I didn't think about this prior. I literally have nothing on this character. Do you, uh, do I have, you have um, a portable I have provision or token? I do not. I don't have anything right now. I can pay you guys for food if you want to sell me some real quick. Have trouble steak. Is that good for him? No. Uh, steak. Give me a sec. Yeah, um. Do you want peppermint oil? No, hold on. No. Hold on, guys. Hold on for the food. Sorry. No, I got him covered, board. We're good. I didn't, I didn't even think about this before I came in here. Are you good? Could sell him with a merchant if we have to. That should be an hour's worth, so you should be good. Cool, thank you. Are you waiting for me, boy? So, food and what else did you say? Food and utility. Make sure it's popped. I don't have any utility. Uh, what are you? Weaver. Uh, power? Mm-hmm. Uh, uh he's, got, he's got the Ron food as well. Yeah, is, scrub what, what out right his, now. What is his food, butternut? Uh, he's got... Yeah, yeah, no it, it's standard power food. Hang on, uh... Oh, shit, I have a count. Hold on, I can send you tins. Uh, but I don't have butternut. I have uh, the compound, uh... I have, I'll, I got him too. Four, don't worry about it. Alright, I'll send him, uh, the tins. Thanks for, for the help. I got ten seconds on my spirits again. I didn't realize how fast they go down. Yeah, it's pretty quick. Um, is everybody audibly ready? Because if I hit yes, are we going or are we waiting? I'm going to re-ready. Mm -hmm, I'm ready. Okay. Okay. I'm re-readying. Yeah, we, yeah, it's always okay. good to wait, red. Okay, that's eaten and... <clears throat> okay, I'm ready. Oh, God damn it, thank God. <laughs> <laughs> stack tight, stack tight, very tight, very tight. I see this way. There he is. Yeah, I don't think I have aggro. Oh. Stack tight. Stack tight. In the group. Damn. Stack tight. Break his bar. Break his bar. We have two people down and one person dead. What is going on? We're GGing right now. We're GGing right now. My bad. Sorry. Yeah, don't panic. Stay in the. Yep. So, during when he's pounding the ground like that, um, you do not want to do anything but auto attack. Otherwise, you'll send yourself straight into down state and dead state. That's right. Okay. Thanks for fleeing. Good one, Salsi. So. If you're a dragon hunter, you want to actually swap to scepter and do scepter auto attack. That helps better. I uh, like getting your damage. I think uh, arrow. You can put a marker on the the firebrands, so we make sure we get below them. 
Um. No. Nope. Everybody should be stacked though. Yeah, shouldn't need that. Okay, okay, okay. Shouldn't need that. So I am one of them. I'll, I'm the tag, but I'll be across the group from you. Oh my god, I didn't charge it. Will I get in soon enough? I yeah. did. Okay, CC. CC. We'll get out of the group. We were close on that one. Um, DPS across the entire group is strangely consistent. We're all at like the same damage. Okay, which means we all need to push a little bit more. Hey, hold, hold on. You're you're a druid, right? Who's no. our druid? Who's our druid? Ranger. 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 All right. We can solo druid then. All right. Uh, we don't need Epi for this. I should get rid of this skill. Um, Epi is actually really nice for the ads, for the ghosts, so we don't have to oh, pull them in. Oh, the ghost. Okay, you're right. Yeah, yeah. You're so right. If, you, if save Epi for that so we don't have to pull them in, that actually helps a lot. Um, hey, um, I'm going to be honest. I have no clue why we just wiped. What just happened? So, we needed to get the boss down to 66% before okay. that orange ring fills out. Yep. That's what I was thinking of it, but I was not sure. Yeah, Epi right. can reach some orb. Orbs, yes. It is a 900 skill range from the target that it hits. So it's about the range of your guys' Scepter Auto. Um, that was pretty messy. I know I did not play that well. I wasn't giving boons like I was supposed to to the group, so let's try that again. If you can clean up rotations a little bit, this should be a DPS golem when done correctly. Stack tight, stack tight. Do you see? Stack tight, stack tight. Big DPS skills. Big DPS. Just barely. Nice. Everyone to go to arrow. Everyone come to arrow. See these charged souls? We need to kill all four charged souls before they reach Gorseful. So we're going to go around a group clockwise. So next, just follow the leader. Follow Natasha. Follow Natasha. Well, mobilized. Yep, you dropped Entangle a little bit early there, and it took us a while to figure out what we're doing. So this is a they GG. Were, they were almost at the boss, so do I need to wait longer? Yes. Yes, you do. They need to be uh, touching the bubble. Okay. Um. We have another soul beast. Soul beast. It, it was a GG. <laughs> Arrow, we're going to do something real quick just for this run, and we'll see if we can keep up the same shit. Yeah, yeah. 
What are you swapping to? Uh, the Condi FB. Well, okay. Condi, Condi Quick. Sounds good. So, same quickness, same shit, but we should be able to pull a little bit more uh, with the same um, Aegis that we need. Yep. Or um, rather. Healing is going to be a little bit tighter. That should be fine. The only thing that should be damaging you in this fight is when you hit the boss when you're not supposed to. When is that again? During when he is slamming the ground and he has a CC bar. You need to stop attacking him. Or only auto attack. Oh, okay, that's what I thought. I was like, I thought we were supposed to auto attack. Okay. If if we wanted to spice, we could also talk to Blue. We've also done this build before. We could move Blue his scourge to uh, one one two, or I'm sorry, two one two. So at least we can get a little bit of a barrier as well. Um, yeah, the damage is too ongoing though throughout the fight. Okay. There aren't any particular points that you want a barrier. You just want, you know, regen ticking basically. But actually, Ranger, you're running Water Spirit, right? No, Glyph of Rejuvenation. Do I need the Water Spirit? Always run Water Spirit. Never run anything else. Sweet, that sounds good. There is, there's one exception to that, but yeah, always run Water Spirit now. <laughs> yeah. Do people still run healing spring at Messiahs? Is that even a thing? Oh wait, no, because you just run heal safe. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Druids at Messiahs, lol. Do do we need more break bar uh, skills? Uh, no, we're good. We, we should we're be good, good with that. We should right. be good. I was gonna switch start. one if we did. No, we don't have cap DPS. Cap DPS is five people over 20 came in. 22 is... Everyone over. stacked tight. Everyone stacked at height. Okay, slow your DPS. Slow your DPS. CC. All the CC you got. You got an epi going out, Blue? Uh, yes. Woo, much better. Thank Let's you, everyone. Go. Let's go. Wheels charge soul. Quick DPS, quick DPS. Emob. Emob, Emob discharge soul if anybody has it. Good DPS, good DPS. Stack tight, stack tight. We have a block coming here. Tighter. I don't think my character can move. Okay, slow your attacks. Stay healthy. Move out of this. Break the bar now, please. Break bar now. DPS, push DPS. Got it. 
So, there are blue orbs. Do not enter them. Dragon Hunters, any ranged abilities you have, use them here to clear the Spectral Darkness orbs from afar. Okay, everyone move in on that charged soul now. Moving on that charged soul. Careful not to hit the blue ring that's next to us. Oh. On tag, on tag, on tag. Yeah, I was on the wrong oh, one. I'm sorry, was that was my bad. Too. Yeah, me too. Gonna need some mobs in a sec. A lot more than mobs. Okay, everyone GG. So, this phase is especially tight for DPS. The spirits, especially since we're only running a single ranger class with Entangle. That means we cannot have the group split to wrong spots. During that second um, tantrum phase, Gorsful rotates 180 degrees. That's why everyone ran to the wrong spot, is because Arrow is no longer where you think it is. So, Arrow right now is behind us to the southwest. When we do, um, after he does that second tantrum, and we get him down to 33%, it will be to the northeast. Um, either use the mini-map and zoom in on that, or even better, there's this giant white marker over my head. Follow the leader for this whole time. Um, the blue orbs will begin spawning during his tantrum phase at the 66% mark. Um, during that time, dragon hunters, all you need to do, or actually anyone with range, just throw down like a symbol, something, range ability. Um, if you have a shade to cover it, or you, if you can blood and just power it, something to get ranged DPS on them and get the orbs that are near the group. We don't need every orb cleared, just those around <coughs> arrow and those that will exp expand to the group. If they're on the outsides, we don't care about them. As as a firebrand, I will focus those so more of our newer players can focus on group. But um, who's that? Um, Matt, I will ask you to do the same thing with me. Matt and I will focus on the orbs. Everyone else focus on the boss. Uh, light. Yeah, I got to and symbol the orb. Yeah. Hey, when I, I can do that you, as well. Yep, I'll call out and you switch the scepter no matter when I call and you focus on orbs it closest mm -hmm. first and then out. Gotcha. Okay. We're still having issues running in at the same time as a group. It's super important that once we ready up, everyone starts moving. Oh, waiting on Lucera. Perfect. Three, two, one, run. Go nuts with your DPS rotation. Okay, now hold DPS, hold DPS. Break bar, please. Break bar abilities, please. Get out of the black. Okay. Everyone, hard DPS. Hard DPS. Push it, push it, push it, push it. Close, we got it. Go to arrow. Thank you for picking up DPS when it mattered. We're going to try to keep DPS more consistent in those early burn phases so we don't cut it that close again. Stack tight, stack tight. All the DPS you got. Unload it right now because you can't in a second. Okay, stop DPS, stop DPS. And we want break bar. Only CC skills right now. Little more. Everyone up. Get everyone up. 
Fish, 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 fish. <laughs> Matt, do the orbs. Stay stacked on group. Just use a ranged attack to clear orbs. Range, Matt. Got it. Okay, go to arrow. Go to arrow. So, if everyone looks at Matt's slot right now, he has an icon of a ghost floating over I'm his... I'm down. Okay, he's down. Um, if you stand in the blue ring, you'll have a ghost. Look at a little saucy over here. Little saucy. Has this white ghost, this Casper-looking ghost over his head. That means he is dealing about 80% reduced damage and has 25 stacks of vulnerability on him. In order to get rid of that, you need to pick up these yellow eggs um, that drop on the ground from killing um, the orbs. So right now, this is going to be a wipe. We've had too many people um, with ghosts on them, but we can try for it. Wait, did you say wipe? I thought he did. Yeah. Dang it, down I'm sorry. again. It was kind of a half It was a wipe, wipe anyway. Wipe. Yeah, yeah. I was, I was letting the group know that regardless of what we did, it was going to be a wipe. Sorry. But, yeah. No, it was no problem. You didn't do anything wrong, because it was going to be a wipe. Anyway. Yep. So, that... Um, if you stand in the blue ring around orbs, um, you get that little white Casper ghost over your head. You do greatly reduce damage. So... You avoid that by not standing in the ranks. Um, yeah, Sir Positive, I appreciate um, how much you were going out and hunting orbs. That was too much, though. Oh, I don't need to kill all of it. You do not need to kill all of them. We need to l just keep an eye on the ones that are spawning near the group. That are going to be a problem. Oh, okay, those gotcha. Blue, yep, those blue rings. Yeah, I thought I had to kill like all of them. Yep. Um, honestly, all you should be need to do is drop your scepter two on it every once in a while, and you can keep auto attacking the boss the entire time. Just every time scepter two is off cooldown, just drop it on the orb. Uh, light. Yeah, I would do that this time. Cool. Um, we're gonna give this a couple more pulls. I'm actually having a lot of fun healing. Yeah, you're doing good at it. You are you are a solo healer right now. Um, Bor and I are flipping into our F2s just for the tantrum phase when needed. But you're basically solo healing this. Oh, my things are going to go away. Oh. Get new things. Stack tight. Hell? Stack tight. I did not follow my own law. Go ahead and CC, please. CC, please, on the boss. Only auto attack. Only auto attack. Perfect. Unload everything you got. Go ahead and nappy out. Yep. Excellent nappies. So a lot of people pick up DPS. Excellent. Thank you for working on rotations there. Everyone's improving. Okay. See how fast we're killing these charged souls right now? That's how fast we want to be during the second phase. Even with the orbs coming around, this is how fast we want to be. I'm glad I have two extra mobs. Unload DPS. Get as much DPS as you can in this phase. 
before he goes to Tantrum. As much as we can. Okay, play it safe. CC, please CC, please CC. Okay, everything you got. Push DPS, push DPS. Have Epis go out. Good phase. We can clear up this spectral darkness. Do not move into engage spirit yet. Oh, uh, we have another orb that just spawned. Watch the balls. Oh, yeah. Ah! Okay. We gotta move it fast. We gotta move it fast. More DPS. Push it. We really gotta push it on these charged souls. We got one that's standing inside his hitbox. Almost got it. Almost got it. Here we go. Stack tight, stack tight, stack tight. Dodge this, dodge this. So that's a mechanic called eggs. He's going to do that again at the end of the phase. That shouldn't be much of a problem. Just make sure you dodge out. Um, we're going to hold this phase a little bit longer. Only auto attack. Keep your friends healthy. Use heal skills. Do not stand in the black. Stay stacked. It is important you stay stacked. Res your friends. Res your friends. Do not CC. Just kind of auto attack. We're going to try to stay healthy here. I'm going to drop CC now. Stay healthy. Get everyone up. Get everyone up. Hard res everyone. Hard res everyone. We need everyone. Okay, the eggs are coming. Dodge eggs, dodge eggs. Fuck. This is gonna be a tight DPS check. We need to unload everything we have. This is gonna be a tight one. Oh my god. Too tight. Everything you got. Oh okay. man. 3% life. Oh, so close. Ah. The biggest no. issue there. The biggest issues there are that we're running a single healer and we have people taking too much damage during those tantrum phases. That would have been a kill had we not had several people go down. People were going down because they were not standing inside of the group's heal. Both firebrands are giving heals during that phase, during the tantrum phase, but they're fairly short range. So you can't be off to the side of the boss. You need to be stacked on group. Um, Ranger's heals are also fairly short ranged as well. Um, that was a really good attempt. Um, the other mechanic that got us was the thing I didn't explain. Obviously, I only saw two or three people get egged that first time, and I didn't see anyone that second time. So if you did get egged, excellent, you got away with it. I did. I got egged the first time, I will be honest. Okay. Um, the eggs, they're basic. Uh, you see an orange circle are going to appear underneath your feet. Dodge roll out. It's going to pop in only about a second, so it's a pretty quick... You see an orange circle, get out. Pretty straightforward. Not a whole lot to that mechanic. If you do get stuck in an egg, you can use your special action key to try to break out. But more reliably, people will have to damage your egg to break out. We have enough cleave in our composition with the number of firebrands, dragon hunters, even daredevil skirt. Yeah, everyone here pretty much does some amount of cleave. Um, so that shouldn't... Some you shouldn't amount, be stuck. amount of what? Cleave. What's cleave? Um... Damage when you, you hit do. multiple foes. Yes. Okay. Um, since you, there are enough damage skills in our kits that are going to hit multiple people, um, no one's going to be stuck in an egg for very long. Hey, so I've got a question. Yeah. Um, I'm kind of looking at my DPS as the the aggregated. Is it worth it, or would you rather me go on a higher DPS class? Um, you are a significant DPS increase for the entire group because of giving alacrity. So this 6.3k DPS, that's okay? Um, It's low, but yeah, right. it's okay. 
Okay. Ah, I'm doing cool. Two, okay, with that swiftness. Yeah. I like it. Yeah. Excellent. Uh, Good night and good luck on loot. Thank you, sir. Thanks, Killjoy. Hi, Killjoy. Yeah, I'm focused so hard on heals, I'm not providing permanent might to you guys. Well, let me double check log real quick and actually see. We shouldn't be having might as an issue between Boar and I as well, because we give a fair amount of might. I um, usually I'm give not... permanent might to the whole squad, but I'm prioritizing my heal skills over my might generating. Um. All you got to do is hit four three two when you're in CA. CA. Right. That's why I'm I'm hitting three first to get the quick draw on that, so I can heal you guys. Stop using quick draw. I'm granting might as well. We should be fine. Oh, I'm not running quick draw anymore. Shoot. I keep <laughs> thinking. I keep thinking like I am. So okay, that doesn't matter then. Yeah. Yeah. I toss might as well. We should be all right. Um, I'm looking at mo logs buffs. Um, yeah, might was group one average 18, group two average 19. That reports about three or four stacks low on average, and that includes split phases as well where you're not on the group. So we are pretty oh. good. We are plenty yeah, good. Yeah, I night. forgot it's probably going down during split. Um, quickness is a little low in group two, and it looks like it's particular individuals it's low on in group two. So I'm going to guess that is stacking issues. Make sure you are stacked tight on the group. Four is standing in the middle of the group, so quickness should be good. Uh, um, I actually will stand off the group to watch people try and stack, and we're not. <laughs> yeah. So um, I will literally aim at everyone, and not everyone is where the aim is. I have a cone of 150. Uh, I'll come and show, but the cone is small. The stack is important. The cone... Yep. Everyone, if if we can look at old purple. All right, look, 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 look. Cone, cone, cone. Very small. If you're stacked, I will stay off of you and cone you. Sounds weird. That sounds really weird. <laughs> Doesn't it? It sounds pretty awful. And you're running feel my wrath as well, right, boy? Of course. <laughs> okay, just making sure. Not that I doubt you. You. Oh, maybe one more time. <laughs> Sorry. Okay. Um, Fury looks good. It's just individuals that are not getting Fury. Uh, it's, they're not stacked. Uh, that's fine. Okay. Yeah, uh, individual people are doing just fine at keeping boons up. So it's just stacking for them. Food check. Yep. Food utility check. We're only going to give this a couple more pulls, but it is worth Booting up, because if you do not, we will not meet the DPS check. Okay. Wait, 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 wait. Yeah, the other thing you can do, Ranger, is go into CA and do your CA5, which will give everyone more immobilize as well. Wait, what? CA5 immobilizes as well. So it's a good Well, background. I use that for CC, right? But that also helps immobilize. Um, okay. uh, yeah, you don't want to CC here, Ranger. That's not your job as a Ranger. As uh, Cupcake, you got 30 minutes left on your soup. You're good. It's an hour oh, long okay, food. Okay, okay, okay. Yeah, yeah. Sorry. You're good. All right, my spirits are dead. Okay, waiting on Lucera. Um, okay. You might want to wait a little bit longer because I don't have spirits anymore. Oh, I just... Give me like five seconds. Oh, Are you ready? Okay. Ranger, Ranger ready up on your... Okay, we're going in. Stack tight. Stack tight. Big DPS, big DPS. This is an important phase to get all your DPS out. Because now we can't. So stop your DPS, CC instead. CC instead. CC please, CC please. More of it. Okay, 
Hit the boss really hard. Hit the boss really hard. Epi, please. Deep. I'm working. Come on. I'm having issues. Got it, just barely. Nah, get with the group. Oh, that's four. Okay. okay. That spirit died quickly. Thank you for your focus. Keep it up. Beautiful. Stack tight. Oh, fudge. Big DPS, big DPS. Weird, he wasn't supposed to do that. Okay. That threw me off. CC, stop your DPS and just CC. Stack tight on group for heals. Stack tight for distorts. What? How? Oh, that was from the. Never mind. Spirits. Spirits need to be pulled. Focus, spirits. DPS. 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 Push it. Push it. Got it again. Go to arrow. We need to clear the spectral darkness. Perfect. It's being cleared. Okay, jump on that charged soul now. Jump on him. Kill him fast. Kill him till he's dead. Um, what is going on? Okay. Next charged soul. Nice, nice immobilize. Last one. Back tight. Dodge out, dodge out, dodge out, dodge out, nice. dodge out. Back on group. Back on group. We're going to delay this. Do not attack the boss. Delay this. Get out of the black. Auto attack. Do nothing more. Ooh. We want to pop them around 20%. Pop them around 20%. Stay stacked on the group. Stacked on the group. You get heals. Okay. Big heals. Big heals. Big heals. Oh, rip. Healers down. Squads I'm down. Me, I'm so sorry. Okay, this is a GG. Shit, I'm didn't sorry. see the second egg. We were What was all that damage? Was it a slam? Um, standing in the blacks. <laughs> yeah, I thought they were over <laughs> with. Sorry, they that was sorry. Light. So once you see the black goop. It won't damage you until about three seconds later. Oh, okay, that's why. That was a bad run for me, sorry. Yeah, I messed up at the end. <laughs> your fr your freaking name's Arrow crack me up every time I read. Hang on. Hang on. Uh, hang on. One one sec. One sec. One sec. I'm really glad you guys maybe played Druid. I'm having lots of fun doing it. It's good. It's a really nice change. Yep. 
as a whole, our DPS, that particular run was a little bit lower on average as a group. Um, but I think that's because most of us were in downstate for like the last 10 seconds of that fight. I think for consistency, um, we can kill this boss. Let's updraft the last phase. Yeah. So we're going to add one extra mechanic here. Um, how we were supposed to do this boss, one of the mechanics we've been ignoring is when he does that giant world eater attack, we're supposed to go to the edge of the arena and kill one of the walls. They, they work like the spirit walls from Spirit Run. Um, and then take an updraft to glide off of the stage and then come back on to avoid the giant world eater attack. Um, we don't do it for the first two phases because our DPS is good enough to ignore it and it takes a lot of time to do. The third phase we've been cutting close enough that I think it's worth doing so we can secure um, the kill. So how that's going to look is we just want to make sure that blue orbs stay off of arrow. And after he's finished with his tantrum attack, I'm going to drag the boss over to arrow and we're going to DPS the wall. We're going to sit and DPS the boss continually over at arrow for a while um, until he does world eater, light off the stage, come back, and he's going to go back to the top of his animations. Um, Cupcake and Boar, I'm just explaining that we're going to do updrafts for the last phase. Uh, no worries. No worries there. Uh, what? So, updrafts um, around the arena. Mm -hmm. um, like, you just glide onto this arena off of an updraft. There are multiple updrafts placed around the edge of the arena. So, during the final phase, after he's done doing his tantrum attack, I'm going to drag the boss over to Arrow, and we have to attack the wall that's there. Um, then we're going to continue to DPS. Yeah, we're going to continue to DPS the boss until he does his giant world eater attack. You're going to continue to DPS him until I call for the group to jump off and glide. Do not jump early, or as Ranger says, um, it may despawn the updraft, and that's just time you don't spend DPSing the boss. So we're going to wait relatively late before that jump. So again, it's just going to be another follow the leader mechanic. DPS what I tell you to DPS. Jump when I tell you to jump. And we should be good. Okay. We're gonna get... Arrow, after this pull, I want to go full DPS. Um, After this pull, I want to go to bed. Nah. Yeah, we're going to beat it this time. No, well, because we're not, no, not going to um, have another poll after this. Well, just FYI, we have APOV who wants to join. He may not be able to leave, but what? maybe Bort can lead and APOV can join. What? What? I think the point people are making is we're going to kill it this time. Yeah. No. Okay. yeah I didn't dead. hear that. I didn't hear that. Oh, I didn't repair, but that's okay. That's a uh, bold statement. Um, we've gotten consistently to that third phase now. And the only thing we're missing is DPS. We're going to CC during that third phase, that tantrum, sooner. Uh, so that we don't risk going down to the blacks like we did last time. So we're just going to do this whole fight safer during that third point. So that we can ensure that we get the kill. The, if, if I can do math, it's 18 to 17 with low DPS that you want to break. It's 18 to 17 with low DPS. With high DPS, you want to break it 20, if not higher. It's for us... It needs to be 18 to 17 break on third base. Um, well, we died. Yeah, well, we died at that point when it was at 21. So instead, we're going to do updrafts to cover for that. Fine. Stack tight. Run and stack tight. Hold your DPS. Just auto attack. Stand in the group, though. Stand in the group. Stand in the group. Get him up. All right. CC, please. CC, please. Okay. Big DPS. Big DPS. Epi, please. Yep. Yeah.
Oh, that's the cleanest we've gotten that. Come to arrow. Beautiful kill. On to the next. No. And this last one. Second to last, excuse me. Back tight. Big DPS, big DPS. Big DPS. Okay, hold it, hold DPS. So you see, please. Dig it. Epi? E oh. Yes. Late on the Epi. The ads uh, started yanking us around. Dig. Okay, come to arrow. Come to arrow. It is clear for us, thankfully. Next charge soul, do not stand in the blue circle next to it. Eris, you stood in the uh, circle around it. You're going to need to pick up a golden orb. Eris, run out and grab one of the golden orbs. Eris, oh, over, on, over on board. Yeah. yeah, you. Over on me. Over on me. Ah, oh, shit. I took Sorry, we got to kill... Matslot, you stood in one of the circles. Here. Nope. They got too close. This is GG. All right. So no, I don't understand what happened there. I've been doing just like I've been doing and throwing my immobilize, and I saw the line go right over that guy, and he didn't immobilize. You know, because I've been using my staff four and my jacaranda two to immobilize them, and that time it didn't work. Uh, you were were good. That that technically wasn't why we would have failed that run anyway. So it was yeah, because of. It was yeah. because of me, I'm sorry. No, 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 not not cause. It happens. It happens. Don't take blame. It's training. Uh, but Ranger, sometimes that shit does happen. It doesn't really show too well. Uh, what had happened, Lusa, is when those blue orbs spawn, they spawn a very large AoE. If you get in that AoE, it puts a like kind of Ghostbuster symbol above your head. I didn't even see it. <laughs> but so, they, no, 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 no. I'm glad you called it out because I didn't even know. I didn't realize that. So try and stay more on the tag. Try and zoom in your camera uh, if it helps on the minimap. Um, but just try and stay on the tag for that run. And we should stay around that. Matt. Uh, you, when that happens, after we face him from that 66%, uh, that's where you stay in Scepter, and you start doing the closest orbs to the group clockwise, if you can. Mm -hmm. uh, okay. So that'll that be your focus. Nobody's mad at your DPS. You're clearing the way so we can clear the spirits faster. Mm-hmm. I'm sorry. No, no, don't <laughs> apologize. I'm give us one more pull. Uh, I gotta go to bed. Okay. All right. Thanks for changing. How long before I have to go to bed? All right, All right. guys, come on. Let's do it right yeah. this time. Let's go. Okay. Right um. in. Big DPS here. Okay, hold it. Go, go, go. Back oh. on group. Back on group. Whoa. Did you do that? Most people are standing in blacks. Thank you. Big DPS here. Happy out.
Well, I got pulled. Well. Everything you got. Just in time. And the arrow. Stack tight, stack tight, for blocks. Alright, Matt, right now you stay in Scepter and you kill all the close orbs, please. Oh, uh, light. Big deeps, big deeps. Okay, stop your deeps, stop your deeps. CC, please. Big DPS now. Big DPS now. I don't know how they got missed. Perfect. Alright, Matt, Scepter? All yep, I'm orders. doing Scepter and the alt. Focus is pulling in these ads. That's why we have blue under us. Do not attack that ad yet. Do not attack it yet. We gotta get Spectral Darkness. Wait for it to despawn. Now attack it. Go quick. Go quick. That's gonna cost us time. Matt, your job, just kill the closest adds while staying on target. Always saying Scepter this round is Dragon Hunter, it's okie dokie. Yep, I'm doing Scepter. Perfect, thank you. Yeah, I'm not switching from Scepter. Nope, stay, just do the mm -hmm. closest ones to us. Matt, I'm gonna target one, do that one please. Everybody else, cool. stay, stay on. Charge focus. Okay, air was clear. Okay. Act tight. We have to dodge, dodge, dodge. Oh, it's me. Oh. Big DPS here. Big DPS. Okay, now hold it. Hold it. Hold your DPS. Stack on group, stack on arrow, behind the boss, behind the boss. We're gonna heal through this. You have to be stacked tight for this. Okay, in the center, I want his bar broken now. I want his bar broken now. Get your friends up, break the bar. Perfect, thank you. We're gonna keep him here for a second to kill the adds. We need Epi to go out soon to kill the adds, and then I'm gonna it's move him out. to arrow. Thanks. Oh, shit. Uh -huh. well, this is my fault. Uh -huh. Totally looking at everything. Okay, I'm moving the boss to arrow. Everyone, follow me. Don't go in blue. Um, he's not moving. Yep. No, you Come follow to arrow. arrow. Kill this wall. Oh, and everyone in the group has touched blue now. Oh okay. man. I needed to start moving immediately. Apparently, I have to get going. So, I have to call it a night. If you can find someone else to lead, good luck. So. I thank like you. you too. I think I'm probably out too. Well, yeah, let's do too. one more. Let's do one more. Thank no, you, for Arrow, it. for me. We can't. We can't. Thank you. Arrow. Yeah. There's always tomorrow if people are around. We're pretty yep, close. Yep, there is. It was a good run, kids. Yep, great one.